Teresa, happy birthday. Happy 50th birthday. This is a big one. I have good news and bad news for you. Bad news, you're 50. Good news, I'm not. <laughs> Actually, I'm way over 50, just kidding. I hope you have a great day. Enjoy your special day. And yeah, it's not all that bad being 50, trust me. It's great. Have fun and take care of yourself. Bye-bye. Hello, Lisa Cass. Happy birthday to you. I can't believe you're turning 50. What a number. You look amazing. You are amazing. The 50s is a new 20s, so I'm excited for you. Um, <clears throat> so I have to answer two lovely questions about you. One, what do I love about Lisa Katz? Lisa Katz is amazing. She's funny. She makes me laugh and smile. I love the fact that um, even though we don't see each other every day or talk to each other every day, when we do get together, it seems like time hasn't passed, that we just pick up where we left off. The only thing that's changing is we're getting older and the girls are getting older. But other than that, I think it's amazing that we can still see each other and time hasn't passed. And my most memorable moment about Lisa Katz and the Katzes are the day we left for Europe almost five or even six years ago. She had We didn't even know each other very well. And she said, Didi, I'm going to see you in Barcelona. And I thought to myself, yeah, right. I'll never see you again, which is sad for me. But um, I just thought I would never see them again. And sure enough, the Katzes flew all the way to Barcelona and we literally had the best time of our life. That was the most memorable um, trip. Everybody had the best time and that truly is the most memorable moment that I had with you, my love. You're a great lady and I can't wait to see the next 50 years. Bye. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Lisa. Happy birthday to you. Bye. Happy 50th birthday, Lisa Katz. I can't believe it. How did we all get in our 50s? I don't know. I hope you just have a great day. I'm out here at the ranch. You can see the cows behind me. They're, they're saying happy birthday as well. And I have to tell you, I was thinking about you over Christmas. So my kids love fried pickles. Big surprise there, I'm sure, for you. But I was telling them about how when I was pregnant with Taylor, I would come down to Katz's with Melinda and you'd always bring out fried pickles for me. Oh, still love them to this day. Anyway, I'd love to see you sometime. Have a wonderful birthday. Happy 50th. I feel lucky and blessed to count Lisa Katz as one of my close friends. I've known her since she moved from Austin and we've been through a lot of things together. One of my favorite memories of Lisa is when we used to go to spin classes together and it must have been a dare, but she met me at the front door of the gym in a bathrobe and it was hysterical. And a close second, um, of one of my great memories with Lisa is when she showed up at our weekly tennis group with toilet paper stuck to her bottom of her shoe. And Lisa does not take herself very seriously. She's open to having a great time and she's just a lot of fun to be around. She is such a kind and generous person and she's who I have turned to when I needed a friend's shoulder to lean on. So Lisa, happy birthday. I love you. There, Lisa. Just wanted to wish you a happy birthday and send my love. And uh, I'm here in California, and I thought I'd show you where I live. This is my little casita. I live on a little creek right here. It's pretty cool. And let's head on inside. Here's my house. Guess you guys have never been here. Maybe someday. And got some wetsuits, doing a little surfing. Got my my little firebox to keep me warm. And this sweet little room in here. The creek creek room. And yeah, that's about it. I hope you're doing great. Love you. Bye-bye. Hello, Lisa. Happy birthday, friend. Have a wonderful day. 50 years old. It's, you are amazing. 
you are strong, you are brave, and you taught me a lot of things this year. I'm very proud of calling you my friend, and I, uh, uh, we love you, Charlene loves you, and uh, have a great day. Bye. This is take number six. I think it's take number 10. <laughs> We're getting tired of Happy it. birthday, Happy birthday, Lisa. Happy 50th birthday. Uh, wish we could be there with you, but uh, this last year's made what used to be pretty simple a little bit more difficult. But uh, it's been great having you in our lives these last 20, uh, 25 years. You brought months. a lot of sanity to the family uh, <laughs> that we probably didn't have before, and that's been great for me. Yeah, and uh, how about uh, those two wonderful great nieces you brought for her? Oh, God, you guys are the best parents. Anyway, we're gonna, I don't want to go over the one minute here, but we just think the world of you guys. And Lisa, thank you so much uh, for being in the family. Barry, thanks we for being here. We love you, Lisa. We love you, miss you. You've made our life complete. Yeah, more complete. More complete. More we're, complete. You know, anyway. But, uh, yeah, I'm looking at 105. It's time for us to say goodbye. We be, hope you have a wonderful birthday. Bye now. Lisa, happy birthday, sweet friend. Can't wait to celebrate you properly. I know you've been given a doozy of a situation. You've handled it beautifully, and I know it hasn't been easy. But we love you. Happy birthday. Can't wait to celebrate you. Happy birthday, Lisa. We miss you dearly, and I miss my friend. I hope he's doing okay without me. Would you please check on him? Love you. Love you, Lisa. Happy birthday. Happy birthday, Aunt Lisa. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Aunt Lisa. Happy birthday to you. I can't believe you're doing that with the 50s. We love you. Happy birthday. We're so happy we got to see you in Florida. We hope you're well. We miss you. Have you. a great birthday. Happy 50th. We miss you. Love you. love you. Love you. Hi, Lisa. 50 years. Where did they go? It just seems like yesterday that I was setting up a card table to be a dressing table for you. Getting the lotions and the creams and the wipes and the diapers. I was so excited, I couldn't sleep. And then finally, you came home from the hospital. And that's when your mother, every day, she would dress you in different outfits, multiple times a day. And I said to her, stop already. You're driving her crazy. That's my job. And I think I did a good job driving you crazy. Uh, for example, a few years later, Santa Claus came, what did he put in your stocking? Soup, Campbell's soup. And on Hanukkah, what did you get? Tuna fish, and you hated tuna fish. But we got the privilege of watching you grow up through elementary school, junior high school, Bat Mitzvah, graduating high school, college and uh, along the way you uh, brought home a boy from Texas and you were so nervous what would we think would it be thumbs up or thumbs down well guess what it was thumbs up we like Barry yeah we did and then we had the privilege of watching you get married and have two beautiful children of your own, my beautiful granddaughters, Stella and Emma. And uh, what more could someone ask? We've been so proud of you and everything that you have done. You have a beautiful life and a beautiful family. And at this point in your life, I would like to officially welcome you to the club. What club is that, you ask? Well, it's the Altacaca Club. Just kidding, you have a little bit more time. Not much, but a little. Sweetheart, I love you dearly. And I just want you to have a happy, happy birthday. Love you.
Lisa, listen here. You are really hard to say happy birthday <laughs> to. And it's not because of you, it's because of us. <laughs> we can't because say it. It, it takes We a can't minute. say it all together. We've been trying to do it for 45 minutes now. <laughs> and it's not easy. It's, this is hard. I can, I would not make it in Hollywood. So, um, anyway, I'm going to say happy birthday, and then most people can say whatever they want. Happy birthday. I love you. Sorry, we couldn't do a proper yeah. happy birthday. Anyway, um, happy birthday. Happy birthday. Bye bye. You're the best. Bye. Happy birthday, happy Lisa. Birthday, Lisa. Happy birthday to you. Happy, happy birthday, birthday to you. Cha cha cha. Happy birthday to you. Cha cha cha. Happy birthday, Miss Lisa. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, Miss Lisa. We go back a long way. <laughs> Starting in 2008, from the Market Street to California, and now back to Houston, we love you. you. Hi, Lisa. Happy 50th birthday. I just wanted to tell you how much I admire your strength and your courage that you've had this year. Um, you've just fought so hard and I've been so proud of you and I'm blessed to be your friend. Um, I wanna say that probably my favorite memory um, of you is that I love our little lunch dates that we have where we get to catch up about the lovebirds and exchange advice and encouragement. And we are just so thankful that you've raised two amazing daughters that my family just adores. And um, especially Stella, um, she has been such a blessing to Jackson. She's so um, kind and caring and thoughtful and of course beautiful and smart. And we're just so um, lucky that She's in Jackson's life and in our family's life, and you've done such a good job raising both of the girls. Um, you should just be very, very proud. Um, I hope that your family spoils you um, for your birthday, and I can't wait to celebrate with you soon. Love you, bye. Happy birthday, Lisa Beth Berwick Katz. Hope you remember this picture from back in the early 90s when we went on a trip to the Bahamas. Wow, that was really fun. I love meeting you, love meeting your family. Your mom and dad were awesome to me. Hey, remember your dad's big TV? That thing was amazing. Anyways, please have a wonderful day and bless you, bless your family, and I hope to see you again someday. O-M-G. Lisa Katz is 50. I can't believe it. How could you look so good? I don't know, Keith. Look at her. She's amazing. I mean, what what do we say about Lisa Katz? What what don't we say, actually? It's amazing. Lisa's amazing. I've never met anyone more fun, stylish, generous, caring, talented, according to Megan, a hundred times a hundred, the best chef in the world, AKA Mama Kitty. <laughs> Mama Kitty, we going on. But yes, Lisa is one in a million, and we feel so blessed to know her. So, without further ado... Happy birthday, Happy Lisa! Happy birthday, Lisa! We love you, and we are so thankful to have this opportunity to speak to you on your 50th. Um, I will start off first as one of my favorite memories, because I think it says a lot about you. We all went to Lake Livingston, and we all know Lake Livingston is not very, the clean waters of the Bahamas. It is the jewel of East Texas. And we were driving up from the water in the boat and we see Lisa on the dock with Matthew. And it was a sight to be seen that's still etched in my mind. There's Lisa, dressed beautifully, designer sunglasses, looking gorgeous, with a big, big Lisa smile on her face. And Matthew is there so happy because he caught a dirty, stinky catfish at a Lake Livingston. And Lisa's there trying to help Matthew take the fish off the hook. 
and it was it was so beautiful and it was so telling of how Lisa just has so much wrapped up in her beautiful body the kindness the caring the gamer um, to help our son get that fish off the hook and I can still see that bright smile and those beautiful sunglasses that beautiful outfit on the dock and it just brings back so many wonderful memories of you how about you well one of my favorite just all-time memories of Lisa and activities is our daily exercise our weekly exercise routine twice a week for five years we have met and been each other's accountability partner the other thing that I love about Lisa is she loves jewelry just as much as I do but probably more and so Lisa one of my favorite memories is you and I talking about diamond searching and you and your diamond adventure I loved every minute of it and you deserve everything and more and I can't thank you enough for being such a good friend to me always you're always there for me as you are so many other people and we are all blessed to call you friend I love you Lisa happy 50th birthday and I can't wait to celebrate with you live we love you very much Lisa thank you for being such a great friend thank you for being such a great part of our lives especially during those wonderful elementary school years with our kids mm-hmm. we will always be thankful for the love you generally have shown our children Megan Luke Matthew you treat us like family and we honestly will never ever forget it so we love you love we you, celebrate Lisa. you and wish you all all the best many happy- more hello from Atlanta Georgia I want to say happy golden 50th birthday to my dear friend Lisa, who I love dearly um, and I wish I could celebrate with you in person. Uh, We have so many amazing memories over over the past probably 40 to 45 years uh, growing up together. We had sleepovers together every weekend. Um, We hung out in the pit at your house watching movies. We went to Meg Serreto Dance Studio and had our recitals together and then went out to Jackson's Ice Cream afterward to celebrate. Um, We would make up our own dances and then perform them for your mom who was uh, very graciously sitting and watching us all the time. and uh, we shared everything, uh, including your boyfriend at the time who I brought to prom with me as my prom date. Um, And my family loves you like you're part of our family and I love your family like they're my own. So I just wanna say happy, happy birthday and I hope that we can celebrate together um, in 2021, um, if that's hopeful, so we can do a double 50th and maybe do a girl's trip. So anyway, lots of love to you, to Barry, the girls, uh, Gary, your dad, and everybody. And I hope to see you soon. Happy birthday. I love you. Take 20. Lisa is 50. Lisa is fabulous. Lisa is special. She's a true friend to us. We always know who to call when we need help at the mall. Lisa always has the best taste of us all. Lisa is funny. She sure makes us smile. We feel so lucky when she's within a mile with more jewels than the queen and enough shoes to fill the sea. Lisa, you're an icon and our number one. Lisa has compassion. With a smile lights up the room. Lisa, you inspire us. But we don't dare call till noon. Lisa, your smile lights up the sun. When we're with you, it's always fun. Lisa, we love you. And we're done.
Estas son las mañanitas que cantamos, Rizli. Hoy por ser tu cumpleaños, te las cantamos a ti. Feliz cumpleaños, Lisa. <laughs> Sorry, it's not a real me, uh, mariachi sombrero, but I want to wish you a very happy birthday. And I want to thank you for everything you've done for me and for always being there for me. And you're one of the most amazing, caring, and loving woman that I've ever known. I really admire that about you. And they're always there for us. So thank you about that. And I hope we get to make a lot more memories together in the years to come. And I hope we get to shop and return and decorate rooms and find amazing things for the girls' birthdays, birthday parties. And being around you is so much fun that it's just amazing. And I'm sure everyone feels the same. So thank you for that. And I'm so lucky to have you in my life. Happy birthday. I hope you enjoy. I need a lot of cake and celebrate life. And thank you so much for everything you've done. And I hope to see you soon to give you a big, big hug. Feliz cumpleaños. Hey, Miss Lisa, guess who I found? Yeah, the other half. We uh, were just talking the other day about how much you meant to us, and in particular, Asa and Asa started telling me about California. So here you go, Asa. Happy birthday, Miss Lisa. I just wanted to say that California with you guys and the whole family was super, like, really good time in my life, and uh, thanks to you for taking me out there. Happy birthday. Happy birthday, Lisa. You are a, a big part of our lives and we just want you to know we love you. Bye. Happy 50th, Lisa. Lisa, hi. We're so sorry we're not there to celebrate with you, but we wanted to wish you an amazing birthday filled with all the great, wonderful things that you deserve. We love you so much and we just can't wait to celebrate with you next time we see you. And uh, we're also supposed to talk about uh, some things that we love about you, some special memories we have about you. And one memory that I always have is coming down to South Florida from New Jersey, growing up and staying with you and Gary, Uncle Steve, Aunt Sarah, having a blast. But one of the best memories was actually coming and picking you up and having to lie to Gary that we're taking you to your friends. And I figure now that you're 50, we can tell you the truth. You see, your brother had a problem wetting his pants. And my dad just didn't want him ruining all our furniture. So that's why we can never bring him to Boca until he outgrew this phase at the age of 14. So that's one of the memories. One of the other memories, of course, is torturing you. And that was with love, with Dumbo, the Shmatakune, Twinkle, your beautiful bird. But all in all, we love you. I'm so happy that we're continuing to be able to spend some special moments together and our kids get along so well. And we just want to wish you health, wealth, and happiness. So. Happy birthday. We love you so, so, so much. And I love when you guys always come down and we cannot wait to see you. Just, I hope you have the best day ever. Love you so much. Happy birthday. And Sammy also wishes you a happy birthday. He wishes he could be with us, but he's at FSU doing whatever he's doing. So happy birthday. We love you and many, many more and can't wait to see you soon. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Bye -bye. June, one word that comes to mind or a phrase. When I say the words to you, Lisa Katz. Loving. When someone is sad or not happy, she always has the right ways um, to pick them up. Mmm, she definitely does. Joey Falcone. Give me the first thing that comes to mind when I say Lisa Katz. I think of polite, because whenever we're at the dinner table with the Katzes, she always has her napkin on the lap and holds her fork correctly. <laughs> My favorite memory of Lisa Katz, and one of the things I miss most about living in Texas, are our weekly walks and talks. She is a friend who listens, she loves with all of her heart deeply and passionately, and she puts everything into her friendships. You are so dear to me, and I'm so excited we get to celebrate you this way because there's no one more deserving. So happy, happy, happy 50th birthday. And I'd like to say that you hit the mark on the first 50. And as all of you know, who are making other videos, there is no one better to lunch with than Lisa Katz. 
There is no one better to order for you. And so like I do when I lunch with Lisa, I'd like to kind of have this be my mantra for life because she's such a good example. I'll have what she's having. I love you dearly. Happy birthday. Lisa, I think you've gotten your first 50 years correct and are surrounding yourself with friends and family and those that love you and those that put a smile on your face. And I just think back of one memory, the, the glow and the look in your eyes when we were on a cruise and they brought you a, a bowl of hot French onion soup. I hope your next 50 years every day you have a moment that puts that look on your face. Happy birthday, Lisa. Lisa? Oh, I miss you so much. Uh, just a quick note to say happy, 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 happy birthday. I wish we could be in times when celebrations were permissible and advisable and encouraged, but we are not. Um, basically, I just want to say I miss you. I love you. I hope you have the best day surrounded by your loves, your friends, anything you want to do. I hope it's the best day ever. And as far as some of my best memories with you, I will have to tell you that I don't have one bad memory with you and of you. Um, I do remember some funny things too that pop into my head. <laughs> are when I accidentally sprayed mace in your bedroom in plantation upstairs. We were messing around with it and we were coughing for what seemed like hours. And um, another time I remember when we went to the Bahamas uh, on our spring break. We met a couple of locals on the beach, you might recall that. And you wouldn't stop talking about water sports. Anyway, Great times, great memories, great friendship. I love you. I hope you have the best day. Bye. Hey, Lisa. I'm in New York. I'm in the snow, your favorite thing. I just wanted to say happy birthday and give you a little backstory on how long I've known you and some memories. About 28 years ago, I first met you and I asked you right away how you met Barry. And you said, I saw him moving in and I jumped up to help him. and. The rest is history. Good move, Lisa. Next sweet memory I have is when you came, when you were working at the Four Seasons, came downstairs and I was there. And I'm so happy Barry just asked you to marry him. Showed me the ring. Another good move. So then we had our traveling together. Cabos and Boston, La Jolla, Las Colinas, and then New York a couple years ago. You came here and stayed with me and we were walking the High Line, went to the vessel, Climbed to the, you climbed to the top. I didn't make it. You're a trooper. Then you had your work with Barry. Loved watching you two work together in a partnership. You were so support, supportive of him. And finally, the family. Lisa, you and Barry created these two lovely young girls. Worked together, brought them up, and it was such a teamwork. And so it was like clockwork being in your house. You decorated your home beautifully. And, um, it's a pleasure to see how that, how you raise them. And now they're two great, sweet teenage girls and I'm enjoying them. So Lisa, happy birthday. It's only 50, best is yet to come. Love you. Happy birthday, Lisa Cat. Happy birthday, Lisa. It's Elizabeth and Greg. And we are here to say we hope you have a fabulous birthday. I know you're gonna bedazzle and decorate it and make it one of the best. And I wanted to share my favorite memory of spending the night with you at the Four Seasons Hotel and Lady Gaga and missing our girls trips. I could really use one right now. <laughs> um, but we are so happy that we're still in touch with you guys and Hope the girls and Barry spoil you and you have a wonderful 50th birthday. Happy birthday, Lisa. The, the fondest memory I have of you is uh, when I went to Houston after we had moved here already to LA. <clears throat> I had to go to Houston to uh, visit MD Anderson and you and Barry invited me to come over the night before my appointment. And it was just amazing being able to see your condo but the hospitality you gave me and the dinner you prepared for me specifically 
at least correct me if I'm wrong, Barry, but I think it was specifically for me. I really appreciated that, and I will always remember that. And of course, your smile and your charm, I will always remember that too. And I, I don't want to get carried away because the second question I have to answer here is why do I love Lisa Katz and in respect for Barry, I'm not going to answer that. Happy birthday. Happy Lisa. birthday. And I loved our times coming down to see you guys in La Jolla. And I hope we can do that again real soon. I would love to see you guys and catch up on all the celebrations we missed, but especially Miss Lisa, you're a big 5 0. Okay. Happy birthday, Lisa. We miss you. Happy birthday. Love you. Bye. Bye. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Lisa. Happy birthday to you. Hi, Lisa, my favorite, favorite sister-in-law. I wanted to wish you a happy, happy 50th birthday. Love you so much. There are so many great memories. I came up with two. One of them was when we came to Austin for the first time. I truly believe you drugged Gary so that he would sleep through so you could spend the weekend alone with me. So I thank you for the bonding and for the sisterly love. I also have a very <laughs> fond memory of sitting in the back seat of your mom's car, squeezing hands as tight as we could. Again, another bonding moment where we laughed really hard. I hope you have the best 50th. We love you and send you nothing but good times. Happy birthday. Happy birthday, Lisa. We miss you, we love you. We love spending time with you for the holidays and every other time. Have a great birthday, we love you. Bye. Lisa Beth Berwick, today's February 13th, 2021, a week before your 50th birthday. Your friends asked me to put something together, asking why I love you so much and my favorite memories about you. So, I'll start with the first question, why I love you so much. The answer is simple, you're my only sister. You think it's that easy? I don't think so. Honestly, I love you because you're the most warm-hearted person I know. You're the best mother I know. You're the best sister-in-law. You're the best wife and everything else that comes along with it. Honestly, I think you are like me put in a woman's body. If I had to say it honestly, that's what it is. Second, you want to know my favorite memories about you. Well, that's a little hard also. I have our childhood, when you let me sleep in the bed all the time next to you in your pop-up bed with all your friends who came over. You'd scratch my back when, you asked, when I asked you to. Um, cuddles, twinkles, snowball, snowflake, and the damn cat that you had. So those are some good memories. The memory of you taking dad's car door off. Another good memory. You getting grounded, another good memory. Um, our vacations together, love the memories that we had there. Uh, but honestly, the memories that come to mind the most are the most recent memories, uh, the more meaningful ones. As your kids and my nieces got older, our Thanksgivings together. Um, this last vacation we had together in December any other time we get to get together with the families and everything else, that's what I remember the most. And I look forward to a lot more memories being made, positive memories with our families going forward. But honestly, 50's no joke. I don't know what it's like to be 50. And I have COVID, so do I get to see 50? You better believe I'll see 50. I'll be skydiving at 50. Um, outside of that, there's a little something that everyone's doing for you next week. I really hope that I'm able to be there. My plane ticket is in the inbox. Dad's plane tickets is in the inbox and Allie's plane tickets in the inbox. Time will tell if we're able to be there, but honestly, your husband's doing a wonderful thing. Your friends are doing a wonderful thing. They all love you so much. You're blessed to have everyone in your life. Um, I can't wait to see you if I'm able to fly next week. If I'm not, you're gonna watch this without me and I'm gonna be upset but I know I'm gonna be there in spirit and I'm gonna call you assuming that I'm still breathing and I love you more than anything in this world. I'm your only brother, don't forget that. And call me sometime, or at least return my call. All right, I love you, goodbye. Hi Lisa, I'm so grateful and proud to call you my friend. 
and as I'm reflecting on just some of my favorite memories with you and of you, um, some that came to mind were um, Disneyland and every signature's luncheon I've ever been to um, and just how generous you are with your jewelry, your handbags that you've let me borrow, um, your house you let me borrow for a photo shoot, um, and all the gift cards you've given me through all my uh, you know, fundraising efforts throughout the years. Um, you know, you coming out in your robe when we used to carpool, because I know you're not a morning person. Um, and then just a really funny that I thought of was um, toilet paper on your shoe when we were playing tennis and um, just made me chuckle. But I just have so many um, grateful times that I've gotten to spend with you and I just hope that you have a wonderful birthday. I love you and I know Barry's going to spoil you and this is just the perfect um, gift that we get to give you is just to tell you how much we love you. So, can't wait to see you soon. Happy, Happy birthday, Lisa. Lisa! We love you! Love you, hope to see you soon. Happy 50th birthday, Happy Lisa. Happy birthday. Hope you have a great celebration. Hope you're doing well and that uh, Larry, Benny, uh, even Larry are doing well. Uh, miss seeing y'all. Hope your next 50th uh, is even better than the first. Take All right, care. take care. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Hi, Mama Kitty. Well, hello, best friend. Mama Kitty. Uh, we wanted to say we love you. More than anything, we're supposed to say one thing we love about you. So my one thing is that you're you. And that, you know, I couldn't make it without you. We've all been like family for I don't know how many years. And we love you. Go ahead. Okay, okay I'm not trying to go. Okay, I'll oh, never mind. We're gonna have to start over. I'll go. No, no we're not starting over. This is all kids. But um, I love you for the way how you're so caring. Oh my gosh. How you're so caring. It only has to be. And too bad. And how you care for everyone. You always take care of Emma and me and all of us. And we love you so, so much. Thank you for everything you've done. I love that she's a good chef. And she's Mama Kitty. Look, Mama Kitty. Oh my. <laughs> <laughs> I love that you are so thoughtful and so caring and so loving towards all of us. You've always been there for Ashley and I and our whole family. We can't thank you enough for it. And we all hope you have the best 50th birthday ever. Happy birthday. We love you. I want to stop out. Love you. Love you. Bye, Lisa. Bye, I want to wish you a very, very happy birthday. Happy birthday, Lisa. Happy Love birthday. You. Happy 50th birthday, Lisa. Okay, for your 50th birthday, I'm going to try to do in less than four minutes um, our history of 25 years of friendship. Ready? Okay, here we go. Oh my goodness, I guess this is where I need to go. Well, yeah, my name's Melinda. It's nice to meet you, Lisa. Oh, you just got married. That's awesome. I'm dating a really great guy. I'm hoping that we get engaged soon. Oh my gosh, really? You work at Katz's? His family owns Katz's? Like Katz's never closes? Oh my gosh, I've spent many a late night there after 6th Street. That's awesome. Yeah, I know, I love, the, I love the fried pickles there. Oh my God, and I love food. D yes, I love the chocolate chip cookies here at the Stouffer too. Let's go get some. Looks like the meeting's over, let's go. Cheers. I think this is the beginning of a beautiful friendship. Lisa, oh my gosh, you're not gonna believe this. Ross proposed just a couple of weeks after the fashion show. I'm so excited. 
Yes, I would love to come over to your house and meet Blackie and Zach. Okay, yeah, I'll see you soon. take him home. Oh, Lisa, he had surgery? <gasps> oh, elective surgery. Turn around, let me see your profile. It looks fantastic. Nice, very nice. Um, by the way, I'm having a baby. <sighs> Lisa, I know, it's just so hard with a new baby. I'm having trouble. I'm not getting to see as much. It makes me really sad. I hope we get to see each other soon. Guess what? I also had elective surgery. Oh, okay. So, I'm really sorry that we have to go to court, and I'm really glad. We're in. Oh, very bad. Decided to make a deal. Yay! So glad I could be. Our baby! This one's named Dylan. Oh, one day he's gonna grow up and have long hair and a beard. Hello, Kendra and and Kathy Katz and Jessica and Mary. We're the Poncho Girls. Woo! So fun. Lisa, are you calling to tell me that you're pregnant? I'm sorry, I didn't mean to ruin the surprise. Oh my gosh, I can't believe that we're gonna have babies just a few months apart. This is the greatest thing. You know what? You need be in the room when I deliver the baby. That is gonna be the greatest thing for you because I, when I deliver babies, it's super easy. Okay, okay, bye. Okay, I'm pushing. Oh, oh, please look for real. Oh, no, really, actually, it's not that bad. It just looks bad. Oh, oh, no, really, I'm really okay. Oh my gosh, I had Josh. Oh, Josh. Oh. Josh is so sick, it's so sad. He's only three months old. I cannot believe you're going into labor. Oh, wait, you're not? Oh, what's the ambulance? Why do I hear an ambulance at your house? Oh, Barry's passed out? Oh my gosh, so you're nine months pregnant and having to take care of Barry? Oh my Lord, okay. I'm sure, I'm glad he's gonna be okay. Hello? Oh my gosh, I can't believe you had the baby and I can't come and see because Josh is sick. I'll meet her soon enough. Hey Lisa, what's up? You're moving to Houston? Barry's building a restaurant there. Wow. Oh, well come on, it's just gonna be for a year. Lisa. Don't worry. You 
know it won't affect our friendship. And that year lasted a little bit longer. But never fear because the friendship of Melinda and Lisa did indeed endure through the deaths of mothers, the births of all of our children, through uh, moving our birthday celebrations from the Four Seasons to Brenham, to you and Barry getting a place in La Jolla, followed by Ross and me getting a place in La Jolla, to your breast cancer diagnosis, and now to this wonderful 50th birthday that we are getting to share with my new friend and your old friend, Lauren. Um, I'm really so grateful for our friendship. Happy, happy, happy birthday, Lisa. I love you so much. And um, if I knew how to turn this camera around, I would. <laughs> so I am, I love you. I'm so happy to be here with you. And um, I can't wait for 50 more years together. You and Lauren and I will soon be driving around La Jolla in our matching scooters. Woohoo! Oh, let's see. My favorite memory of Lisa Katz is really hard to pin down. We could start with when we met and her hair was unnaturally purple, which she seemed to be unaware of until later. Um, and then watching movies in her bed with the baby monitors from across the boardwalk apartments to one of my favorites, walking down from the hotel room in our pajamas to go eat in the restaurant. Um, and she got a free cocktail and I had my glass or three of wine. Um, but all of my best memories with Lisa are actually part of why I love Lisa. And it's always a good time, always entertaining. And you know she's there whenever you need her and whatever you need. And she instinctively knows that and she is one of the kindest souls I have ever met. There is not an ounce of meanness or unkindness in her body, and that is something that's really hard to find. So I hope, Lisa Katz, that you know how much you are appreciated and loved for everything that you are. Happy birthday. Happy birthday, Lisa Katz! Happy birthday to you, happy birthday to you, happy birthday to Lisa! Happy 50th birthday to you, Lisa! We love you! Lisa Katz, happy 50th. And I could have left my ski helmet on so I didn't show off this epic moment in my life with this hair, but you know, I had to throw you the Karen. I look like grandma. Um, one of my favorite stories. I wasn't even there for, but oh my God. Sitting in Houston, Texas, and getting the day-by-day, -day, sometimes hourly stories, both on the news and from Barry about you, stuck on a cruise ship, pooping into garbage bags. I, I, it, it, I'm so sorry it happened to you, but I'm not sure it could have been funnier with anyone else. Um, I mean, just the whole thing. I mean, just the circumstance that you even went on a cruise, and especially that cruise, and then that happened. I, I, I don't know what to say about it other than it still makes me laugh to this day. Every time a cruise ship has a problem, I tell other people about you on that boat. Happy birthday. I hope it never happens to you ever again, but if it does, I pray I'm not there. Love you very much. Happy birthday. You're awesome. Happy birthday, Lisa. Have a great day. Here's to 50 more. Hey, Lisa. Hi, Lisa. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. So we're, we were going to walk around Austin and look for your favorite places. And we got stuck uh, skiing in uh, Colorado, but then we're stuck in Denver waiting for a flight. So we came to what we thought would be a place you would approve. We're having lunch at Nordstrom's. Yeah, where else? 
And the last time I had lunch at Nordstrom's was with you. <laughs> but David, what's your favorite? What a favorite memory you have of Lisa? Well, my favorite. One of my favorite memories, of course, is visiting at your new place in Houston and walking through Nordstrom's with the girls, and seeing that that was their their playground and backyard, and uh, you know everything. So I've retold that story. I don't know how many people. And you know what a, what a great place uh, what a great place it is, and how much fun you all have, and because you're such a positive and encouraging person always, and also for introducing us to, or me at least to Keels and salted caramel. That's mine. Oh, not I stole his. it from Chris. I'm sorry. <laughs> Never mind. I, I messed you know, up. He doesn't just Keels, and you did introduce yeah, me to go. salted caramel. Yeah. I'd never even imagined such a thing, and Keels too, which I still use. And but I, my favorite, well, I have so many memories, but a really, really memorable memory was the time that we all looked in my window to see what Jack had done, because he always did things, and we saw the disemboweled possum, and you went, oh, <laughs> and I, we were just all so gross. That was a good memory. But I walked to all those wonderful dog walks, all of them, all the excitement of our children being born. I'm just so glad we've been able to share those things with you. And we are, we, are, we are so wishing you a happy birthday. I cherish you for your kindness and your generosity and your sense of fun. And we just love you and we wish you happy birthday. Here from Denver and from Nordstrom's. Bye-bye. Right, happy birthday. Bye. Happy 50th birthday, my breast friend, Lisa. Como estas? Welcome to the club. Happy 50th birthday. I have so many wonderful memories with you from sunglass shopping, yes. I don't know if I'll go again sunglass shopping with you, but maybe for your 50th, maybe this summer we will do that, to going to Vegas. And let's not forget our lovely, fun, crazy cruise. And yes, I do wanna go on another cruise with you. I, As soon as I'm done with this video, I'm going to go ahead and plan a cruise before we turn 100. Maybe we'll go on a senior citizen's cruise ship. How about that one? Anyhow, sorry I can't celebrate it with you. Have a wonderful 50th birthday celebration and we will celebrate it this summer for sure. Love you and happy birthday. Happy birthday to my favorite niece. This is Uncle Mike. How you doing? Here we have 20 inches of snow over last week and we're gonna get an ice storm later this week. So anyway, hope the Katz family's doing well. And just having some memories of uh, you, Lisa, way back when you were young. Do you remember coming to the farm and seeing the chickens in Vineland, play, playing over in the yard? Or do you remember me taking photographs of you and then taking the photographs and putting it on the blocks and hanging up different photographs of you. That was a good learning experience for me for taking the photos. Well, I hope all is well. I hope you're enjoying yourself and have a wonderful birthday. And hopefully we'll all be able to get together soon. Hey, pretty lady. Wishing you the happiest 50th birthday ever to the most amazing woman. Strong, wonderful mother, great wife, and absolutely amazing friend. And I am better for knowing you and being part of your life. And I hope you have the best birthday ever. Hi Lisa, it's Karen. Happy, happy birthday. Bonnie and I are wishing you the very, very best in 2021 and beyond. Welcome to the 50s. I'm just a little bit ahead of you. And um, nothing to be scared of. It's great. <laughs> um, here's some of your decorating advice for me with my pillows. And then also over here, you can see by the exercise ball, I put um, AstroTurf on our back deck. So not only have you provided um, great decorating advice, <laughs> Um, you just have been a treasured friend, and I remember the first time we met at the boardwalk, I think you were actually feeding Emma a bottle, if I'm remembering correctly. I think that's it. Anyway, we miss you guys, our first friends in the woodlands, and come to Colorado. Bye. Happy 50th birthday to my smart and beautiful friend, Lisa. 
I am so honored to be your friend. I love how courageous, brave, fearless, creative, loving, thoughtful, and so many other wonderful things that I could say about you. Thank you for allowing me to be your friend. The Guidry family loves you, and I hope this year brings you the best birthday and all your dreams and wishes come true. All my love. Hi, Lisa. As I was thinking about what I wanted to say for your 50th birthday, the words that came to mind were consistent kindness. It's been such a pleasure to know you and to call you friend. For Karen and I, I know that your commitment to us and to our family is second to none. If we ever had a crisis or problem and we needed to rely on someone, I'm sure we could call you and you would be there for us. I have no doubt. You're a special person and wherever you go, for whoever you touch, you make life special. It's an honor to call you my friend. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. I will never forget getting to go to Mexico with you and your family or going to California over the summer to visit with you guys. I've always had so much fun with y'all. Um, and thank you so much for always making me feel like I had a home with you before college and during college. Um, I am just beyond thankful for you. Happy birthday. Love and miss you. Happy birthday, Lisa. I hope you have a great day. <laughs> Lisa, happy birthday. Can't believe you made it to 50. It's awesome. When I think of Lisa, I think of a model, a cook, a hostess, great hostess, great decorator, great shopper, great party planner, great real estate agent, but most of all, a great friend. Thank you, Lisa, for all the memories, and I look forward to many more in the future. Have a great birthday. Bye-bye. Birthday, Mom. Love ya. Yeah. You're old. <laughs> I'm messy. I'm cool kid. Love ya. I love you so much. You're the best mom ever, especially when you take me on Target runs. Yeah! This is me. Transitions. I will be okay. Hey, come on! Right to the dance. Mm -mm -mm. Love. I will be L is for the way you look at me. O is for the only one I see. B is very, very extraordinary. E is for the. I don't know. <laughs> You're awesome. You're cool. Oh, yeah. Happy Happy birthday, Mom. I'm so excited for everything that you have to accomplish in your 50s and so many more years to come with you. You are so amazing and you push me every day to be stronger and better daughter and person. I love you so much and we have so many funny memories together. We definitely have to go back to that very amazing nature walk that you had us take and kept reminding us of how amazing that idea was because you came up with the idea. Also, um, I'm so glad your 50 days of 50 was fun, hopefully. And I can't wait until we get to do more amazing things in your 50s and go on more great trips. And I'm so excited to have a great room that you helped me design and just do amazing things, and I'm really excited, and I love you. Happy birthday, Lise. Big 5-0. Well, I'm back here in the closet, Stella's closet, because uh, I have to secretly make this video, and you've been home since COVID and fr the freeze for so many days that I have to come hide back here. But I wanna wish you a happy birthday and tell you that, um, you know, I love you so much. And seeing all our friends make these videos is just amazing. And um, for everyone else to recognize what a huge heart and a huge spirit and what a caring person you are is wonderful to hear. And um, you know, I feel so lucky that you chased me down 30 years ago. And uh, I remember planning your 21st surprise birthday party. It seems not that long ago. And uh, you know, I've loved the journey with you. You have. Uh, having kids with you and supporting me with my career. And, um, you know, I just never thought I'd live in such well-designed places and uh, never thought I'd have the opportunity to buy so much jewelry from around the world. 
um, you know, and just many, many more things that have exceeded my expectation. So anyway, kidding aside, I love you, appreciate you, and look forward to our 50s. Bye.